Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to some Pixar. Got a little bit of renovating done on the base since the last video. Went ahead and uh, built it up a little bit, man. Got quite a bit of stuff done since the last video, so I'm kind of uh, I'm kind of happy with it. Wait, what's going on here? Back off, dude. Think what these dillos? No respect. Well. This guy- oh wait, what's that? Interesting, I have never seen a loot chest drop like that before. But that kind of brings us to what we're going to be doing in this video today. So I'm having a lot of spawns come by here. So I have a fence unlocked, I kind of want to get the stuff to build it around here. And... I'd like to put some up here too. But let me show you what we got, man. Like I said, a lot's changed. Out here, I kind of want to put our workbenches and stuff like that. I do got our forge set up here with a mortar and pestle. Quite a bit of copper and everything like that smelting up. And then in here, I haven't done too much. But, look at the storage cabinets. I went ahead and grinded and got those unlocked. So they hold a lot more than the other ones. These have 50 slots. I think the other ones that we were using had only 15. So that is a huge upgrade. And I have us a fridge. Kind of helps to keep our stuff from spoiling all the time and it's got 24 slots so not too bad I do like it and I did get a bed put up we do have a nice skylight up there so we can see out and see in whenever it is daylight the building the roof is kind of weird in this game so you have to have blocks to be able to put the angled ones but then you can remove them and it makes like a regular roof so it's, it's all in all not too bad then it kind of got out here the same way a little bit. That's kind of flat up top. I was thinking maybe putting my flyers up there so they're safe. But, for today. So, I want to get some wall torches. I have unlocked. Some of these here. So, all we need for those is uh, clay, flint, and wood. Let's get a couple of those made because it does get dark around here. I'll put a couple out here. What was that? Parasaur. And we'll put a couple of them in here. Grab us some wood. I think it was flint and clay, right? Oh, let's put that venom in here that we got. A little bit of flint, and then I think I have some clay left over. Not much. Don't know how much we needed. Oh, wait. Is it down? Yeah, it's down there. Get rid of that. We don't need it right now. How many can we make? Oh, I don't need 37. Let's do... Let's try five. It'd be awesome if we can use clay to put those up. Or not clay. <laughs> Stuck on clay, man. I've been farming clay like crazy to get all this. If we can use coal to power them. Wait, did I make regular ones? Boy, I tell you what. There we go. That's what I want to make. I can make six, so let's do... Let's do five. And while those are crafting, let's get rid of all these torches. I'll tell you what, man. We've got so many torches. And let's take this out. We should be able to place that down today, too. Okay, well, we'll throw that one in there since it's used. Grab a little bit of the coal to see if we can put it in there. Still trying to figure out where I put everything, man. It's kind of it's kind of weird having so much storage. There we go. If not, then we'll throw a bunch of thatch in there because, dude, thatch is so easy to come by. So we can't. Okay. Not a big deal. We'll go ahead and fill that up with four of those. Nice. Dude, that thing is so bright. Oh my gosh. I thought I was going to need a couple of them, but we're going to be getting rid of that one. So we'll put one up here. And we'll put one here. And then probably just, I don't know, maybe one or two in here. Put one right here by the bed for right now. That way you can see when you wake up at night, you know? Nice. Grab the rest of our thatch out of here that we got. We'll save a little bit. I'll farm up more later and we'll fill these up.
Tell you what, we can go ahead and get rid of this one now, too. Yeah, got a bunch in there. Is that the last torch I got? Besides the ones going down? I think it is. Alright, so we need to find some sandstone. The main thing I'm missing for the fences is sandstone. Not exactly sure where to get that at. I'm guessing, you know, probably out in a desert, which we got to find a desert biome. These workbenches, man. How do we want to do it? Right next to each other? Can I fit? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we got nine. So I could probably fit one there. I don't know. We'll figure it out later. What is in here, though? Dude, I tell you what, this thing's out and so loud. It's a compy. So you trying to sneak up on us? Where's your buddies at, man? <laughs> Little dudes. I'll tell you what. All right. So what do we have in here, man? What did this unlock? So we have a spear, ice spear. Okay. Oh my gosh, that damage, man. One forty-five. Or is that just 45? I don't know. And then we have, uh, ooh, a nice little, uh, oh, it says a wand. I thought it was a sword, man. Looks like a little dagger. So that does 50 damage. So that needs a Pegasus horn. What does this need? Dark wood, dark crystal. So we haven't found any of the magical areas yet. And that's an ice shard and a magic wood. And that's some arrows. Ooh, a mole pick. So it's made from claws dropped by magic moles. Hmm. I wonder how well that is for mining and stuff. And that's an ice shield. Not worried about shields. Don't like messing with them too much. Neat, man. Good bit of stuff there. At least we have it. Oh, see, there's his buddy. I knew there's always one, man. There's always another one. Let's go ahead and grab some of this copper before we head out. I farmed up a lot of that from that neat little pile that we found over there with all the coal and copper. That way we can make some... I think we need to make it right here. Copper tools. They unlock it? I didn't. I did. Yeah, here we go. So there's a copper pick. And which one is this? That's the axe. We're gonna replace you. And you. Let's go over here and throw those away real quick. And I think there was another spear, wasn't there? I thought. Maybe. So there's a copper. So what do we want? The spear or the sword? Because that's 25 damage. And that's 40. It may break when used. Huh. So it just has a chance? I don't like that, man. Maybe we'll do the sword. Ah, oh, man, it damages a lot different. Tell you what, let's, what's what's our damage on the one we have now? I think it's only 15, right? 11. So 25 would definitely be an upgrade. I just don't want it to break, you know what I mean? We got a crossbow we could do, too. Can be fired underwater, but not rapidly. Yeah, it's kind of like a normal one. Oh, that's a copper bone sword. Maybe we'll do that one. Oh, we don't, we don't have any bone. Where, where do we get bone from? Hardened bones and copper. Let's just make this. We'll do the sword for right now. We have everything on us. Need to get some leather. And I need to stop hitting the escape button. Life goals, man. One day at a time. Dude, are you out here tearing stuff up? He is. <laughs> That's what you get, man. Turn that off. We don't need it anymore. All right, one new sword coming up. So that one says it may break as well. I didn't realize that. We'll save it for later. We'll throw it in our storage uh, chest here. Clean out our inventory, hit on the... We're going to take the Pterodon out today. It's easier to get around on him. And then... 
Get rid of this extra torch that I have a billion of. I'm slowly kind of learning where I'm putting stuff, but then I come back in and I totally forget. Alright. Awesome. That is most of the stuff taken care of for today. Close the door. Don't want any copies nesting in there. Are you on neutral? You should be on neutral. You're on passive. Um... Wait, we don't want you to go aggressive. Neutral! Ooh. <laughs> he was about to take off. And we got food. And you have food. Right? Food? Here you go. Have some meat, buddy. One thing I want to do... So we can put a marker here, right? I think. Maybe not. Press P to add marker. It's not letting me. Oh, there we go. And then our coordinates are 526 and 1302. Minus 1302. Okay, see, that's a big thing. Try this again. 526 and minus... 1302. There we go. That's a little bit better. Now we know where base is, man. Makes me feel a lot better. Because I have no idea where we're going. We're just gonna fly until we find it. So we have a level up for him, I think. Let's put you into weight. We need a lot of sandstone. Alright, man. We're gonna fly around and see what we can't find. Man, that's a lot of points. I didn't realize. So 525 on his weight. That's pretty good. We'll head towards the green obelisk to see if we can't find some sandstone between here and there. I'm guessing we need to find a desert biome. Another lovely cave. Oh, man. Here's some over here, actually, it looks like. This is just right over by base. We're right over there. I forgot across the water here we saw sandstone and or saw the desert kind of looking biome. So, I don't know. Sand's on top, I think. And maybe sandstone's underneath? That might be it. Hmm? I don't know. Let's take a look. We do need a lot of sand, though, too. I wonder if sand is where you would normally find, like, stone. Nope, because there's stone there, right? Yeah, it is. A rock, sorry. Alright, so that's not what we need. I don't want to fill up on that. Ah, there's a dolphin down there. Is that more flint? That's that's dirt. Dude, we just gotta figure out what it looks like, man, you know? <gasps> right there. Ah, but that's it. Yeah, I know we're hot, man. It's a desert. Ah, sandstone, awesome. So how many do we need for each piece of the fence? So that's the one I was looking at doing. So we also need to make a construction hut, I think. Or maybe that's the one we have back at base. So it only takes one per. What does our weight look like? Dude, what is that? Terror bird. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, I know what you are. Wait, where do we get those magic cords from? Must have been whatever he killed. Nice. Oh, he dropped something, too. Dung beetle. <laughs> they got a little bit of everything in here from work, right? Uh, another territory certificate. We don't want that. Dude, are you really attacking my bird? Holy crap. Well, those are definitely non-aggressive in arc. It's kind of weird. So we got some... Oh, there's some bone pieces. Didn't we need bone? Drop that. Huh. So while we're over here, we'll take out a couple dung beetles. I think they're just gonna drop meat in there, right? I better check. Just to make sure. And we do got a level up available. 
Yeah, it looks like just meat from this. Oh, and some chitin. Let's go ahead and put this into damage. We're getting up pretty hot on our damage, man. We're at 155%. All right, back to our sandstone farming. If we can do it in peace, that would be fantabulous. This uh, pick seems a lot better too, this copper one. All right, man, I think we're doing pretty well. We've got almost 300 of the sandstone and we got quite a bit of sand. I do like how the sand doesn't fall in this like it does in Minecraft. You know, Minecraft, you take a block of sand out, dude, it's gonna come down. <laughs> it's gonna come crashing down on you. But we are doing pretty well and the thing that I like the best is we are not even using hardly any of our inventory space. Or wait, I mean. You need to go into stamina so we can stay flying longer. I wonder if there's any more of those dung beetles around. Just to get a couple more pieces of, the, of that bone. Oh, dude, is that an Argentavis or a, another kind of bird? <gasps> is this a magical area? Biome, whatever you want to call it. It is a gym soldier. Oh, dude, there's spiders. Didn't realize those are spiders. Let's go up top here. I want to see if this is normal wood. Oh, dude, I like how the little sparkles come off the trees. Mage weave bark. Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Why can't I ride my pterodon? Here we go. a very very small area small magical little land here take one more look at these trees oh there's a new a new block too so that's just regular wood and then oh dude oh yep 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 I don't know what that was it's a carno <laughs> you gotta look where you land man I'm just saying all right, here's some here. Let's take a look real quick. Marble. Dude, that'd be nice to do our floor in. Are you aggressive? You're a stego, you shouldn't be. Make sure we don't hit him. Yeah, we should be able to do our floor in this, man. Make it look a little bit better. Instead of just having it all clay. If there's a marble floor, I guess it would be. We'll take a look and see. Anyways. Let's head back to base. We'll get some of our fences going and see where we'll go from there, man. Wonder what level the blue ones are. Take a look, see if we can get something good out of it. Stone essence, okay. We'll go ahead and take those and then an upward track. Oh, I forgot there's train tracks in this. We'll hold on to it. We should be able to connect areas underground and stuff. That'll be kind of neat when we get a couple bases set up. Dillo. Well, I tell you what, those things are... <laughs> they're so annoying. Go ahead and drop the bird here. So those turkeys... Dude, I thought they were like the, the death chickens that are in Ark. But they're not. They're so easy to kill. I couldn't believe I was avoiding them. I mean, we'll leave them alone now. There's no, no reason to get rid of them, but... I hear you. Where you at? Little Dillo. Alright, so we got sandstone. What else do we need for the fence? Oh, that's right. We can't craft it here. It has to be over here. So let's go ahead and just make a hundred of them. Let's offload some of this stuff. Let's take a look to see if there's a foundation that uses marble. Or something that uses it. There is, right there. So we gotta be level 48. So not too bad, man. We'll plan on unlocking that when we get up there. I think we're level 40, so we're not too far off. We'll do this in like marble. I kinda like the way the clay looks, man. It's like normal brick. So we'll store it with our other blocks for right now. Sandstone, I need to start making some glass up with that. Or not sandstone, sand. So the glass, and then you can make the actual glass with it afterwards. Craft a hundred. 
We'll save some sand just in case. And our marble, and I think we're going to throw the wood in there for now. Because it's kind of our bark, sorry. We'll hold on to that, because I don't know how much of those... Well, we'll hold on to one stack. And this is kind of some of that... This is kind of my weird stuff in here. A little bit of wood. And this is like materials and all that kind of stuff. But there are meat in here. Keep it good for later. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, jerky. We need to unlock it. I didn't know they had that in here. What else do we have? A little bit of flint. There we go. Let's see if some of our stuff is done. All 100. Dude! Oh man, these are a lot tinier than I thought. I was like, kind of hoping to put these up out there. I don't think these are going to do anything for keeping the wildlife out. It does look alright though. Can we stack them? Oh, well, we can, we can stack them. So that might work. I need to put some more stairs right here. What do I have here? Three? I do. So two and then the stairs. So let's go ahead and grab some real quick while we're thinking about it. If I can get in my door. Can I get in my door? Talking about having just enough. Luckily, all of that is just down in the water. I need to build a dock, too. We might do that soon. I was expect or kind of wanting to do it just right off here. There we go. At least it's all the same now. How weird is that going to look with two? It does look kind of weird. Oh, man, that sucks. I was really, really hoping to figure out something else to put there. I'd just get out of my hand, man. I'm going to have to move my mortar and pestle. Oh, huh, that's going to be kind of weird, too. Maybe I'll pick that up and just put a block there. Did you get him, buddy? All right, man. Well, I think we're going to go ahead and leave this one here. Got everything done I wanted to today. We got our new weapon. Got the sandstone. I'm going to have to figure out something else for a wall out here. Not sure what I want to do. I want to get rid of some of this here and kind of expand out a little bit because there are some of the big Brontos or whatever they're called in this um, that keep walking up to the house. I had one like on top of the roof. So <laughs> that's kind of something we'll need to address here shortly. However, hope you enjoyed the video. As always, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.